Hey guys, Dale here, back with some more RimWorld, and we have a couple more raiders. They're preparing for a little while, and they seem to have tox grenades, which I don't think is going to impact us or the mechanoids. Um, so we'll kind of let them do their thing and just, like, get trapped in here. It is winter. It um, became very wintry, like, snowy outside as soon as, like, Priya got... Uh, well, actually, while Priya was caravanning back. Um, because of that, our little deserter guest from yesterday did not survive very long out in the cold, uh, and she is gone. We only have uh, seven meals left for Felicia. We don't have a crypto sleep casket for her. I'm thinking that this is probably an ancient danger, um, and we can probably get some crypto sleep caskets from there. Um, so we might pop that open after we deal with these raiders um it would be priya but priya does have she has some psychic powers so i think she can like stun lock mechanoids down if it's mechanoids and we might just have to like resurrect militors um i have changed what control group three is doing they're escorting if there's an enemy Mechanoids will accompany the o but only if there's an enemy on the map. There is an enemy on the map. Why aren't they escorting? Do I have to draft you? Um. Why don't we just say like escort and recharge? Um, and then we'll turn them back off. Uh, but basically, we'll set them to escort and recharge while there is an enemy present. And then um we'll just have them hang out in here because uh, having them follow Priya around constantly uh, requires them to be charging frequently. And we just have these two chargers right now. Uh, we have built our drills. We haven't built a power line out yet. We need to do some mining for that. And we are working on a little greenhouse. So we're going to see how this works. Like Sunlight should be able to come in through these glass walls in a pretty big radius. We've deconstructed the... Uh, the what's it the hydroponics <laughs> wow that word just was like not in my brain uh and i figure we'll build some hydroponics in here because i think we'll need to grow psychoid and heal root in order to create uh neutramine uh, and we'll definitely need that for more androids like priya well like priya before she became a form gel um so yeah, I guess we'll come back when these guys decide to attack us. Okay, they're on their way. We have defensive positions for all six of our Militors. Just down instantly. Down instantly. Okay, you guys are good to go. Let's set you guys back to like escort if enemy and they'll go recharge otherwise. Priya, why don't you strip this guy because we can sell his stuff. And then mechanoids, you guys are unrestricted. So, wait, is that lift turtle and constructoid? Okay, cool. We had to disassemble our original constructoid and reassemble him because I added constructoids can mine. So now that we've got like most of the construction out of the way, whenever there is no construction to do, uh, he's just gonna go go do some mining. So that'll be extra helpful. Okay, and literally I was just letting Priya like meditate overnight. It's the next morning and we have a raid coming to attack us right away. So I guess get into your defensive position and other mechanoids will have you come home. And you guys, yeah, I, I'm not sure why, like there is an enemy present. So I'm not sure why this is escort if enemy. Well, I guess just go ahead and, like, escort and recharge. And if we grab them, defensive positions also work for them. How many is it? It's three, four, and some weapons. Okay. Ooh, what? You lifter. I know you want to haul things. Oh, he exploded. Uh, he must have had, like, an explosive belt on. If we check his gear, yeah. Okay, they are pretty persistent. And we've got all of them down. You guys are free to go. 
once again. Okay, and then I guess we'll just tell you to go recharge. Well, that's not working. Escort. Escort if enemy. Yeah, we'll see how things go. Uh, Felicia, why don't you strip this? Well, no. Yeah, he's still alive, I guess. Uh, he's not going to be alive for long, so we'll leave him alone. They did drop some meals. So that buys Felicia some extra time. Um, I guess we can actually... Priya just had a mental break? Oh, she's freeing memory space. Okay. And the map render. Okay. Yeah, whenever she needs to free memory space, she, like, will not do anything else. Let's grab you. Let's grab the Militors. Let's grab all of you guys, and let's head down this way. Actually. Felicia, you have a gun, so you can come with us as well. Let's check out this ancient danger. Ancient danger, just like we thought. Okay. Outside a loud area. It looks too unrestricted for you. Deconstruct. Let's take a peek in here. Uh oh, it's flesh beast. Oh, this is this is gonna be no problem. Okay, let's grab you guys. Uh Felicia. And there are ancient crypto sleep caskets in here. So let's try and keep you a little safer. Let's have you go here. Priya, you go here. Okay, let's get you guys lined up. Um, unable to order pawn. That's very strange. Let's deconstruct that. Okay, and then let's back off. Uh, interesting that the insects are not hostile. We do have an insect faction. Okay, so you guys are you guys took care of the flesh bees. Um, Militors. See if we can take any of these guys down. Oh, some gold and plasteel. That is great. Uh, why don't you guys try and take that guy down? Yeah, that's very annoying. I'm not sure why we're getting that unable to control pawn spam. Okay, so we did get some gear out of this. We got some plasteel out of it. We also got some weapons. Battle rifle, pump shotgun, uh, auto pistol. Uh, Militors, you can go home. Prio, why don't you strip these guys? And we'll see if they have anything interesting on them. Looks like a charged pistol. A shard animal pulser, some glitter world medicine, some luciferium, and we're going to claim all these guys. We're going to uninstall them, and we will reinstall them back at base. Uh, oh, advanced components, very much needed. Uh, you are free to go, I guess. Let's also get this hauled in. And then uh, once we get one of these reinstalled back at base, we'll probably stick Felicia in it at some point. But we kind of still need her around for a little while. I guess we can just stick this like right there. Okay, so that's great news for Felicia. She has a little extra food that some raiders have dropped. We've gotten some more crypto sleep pods that we could potentially put 
other prisoners in, like if you manage to survive, and that is like future brain scan material. That is, we well, we got tons of gold out of these people. I did not realize that ancient dangers were filled with so much gold. And we didn't even open this loot box. Let's take a look at that. Let's speed things up real quick. Um, any other loot boxes? No, just the one. Okay, we'll let people get organized and then we'll summon our first mech boss. Okay, Priya is full on sci focus. She's gained another level. Um, we could unlock Arco technology. This lets her gain meditation focus from meditating at a lot of things like mech gestators, a lot of like biotech technology. Science lets her gain meditation focus from our research facilities. So I think those two are two that I'd like to do in the future. I think I'm pretty satisfied with her Static Lord powers for now. We'll probably increase them in the future, but let's work on her Skip Master stuff. Um, specifically, I want to get down to, like, Far Skip and Skip Door, right? So we might go up, like, this through that tree and then maybe work on her stats or unlocking some more focus types. That being said, let's go ahead and summon the Diabolus threat. She can finish the evening meditating while we wait for those guys to arrive. Oh, I didn't realize that it took so long, but here we go. Okay. Attracted by your mech band signals, an ultra heavy mech from Arthar Artharm or Artharm Mech Hive will arrive soon. Be prepared. Okay, so arrival mech hive okay diabolus is arriving with three militors i think the play is that we like engage them in the field right um priya i guess let's let's get going militors we have seven of them now do we have anything else queued up no so it's her and seven militors And yeah, I'm think I'm hoping she can do some stunning on them. We do have a static aura um, that we can cast, and that should that should like help out with getting an AOE stun going. Oh, we need to deconstruct that. Okay, you guys, let's move forward. Ooh, some thrombos. I might actually be interested in hunting those for the money. Okay, so Priya. Static aura. Uh wait. You can can't you like static pulse? The caster dumps a massive amount of voltage into the surrounding air. That's around her, right? Flash storm, vortex, chain bolt. Okay, let's get in. And you guys start moving forward as well. Okay. Can you chain bolt him and see if that stuns him? It does. He has adapted. Our militors are being targeted now. Let's move you guys up here. Okay. Uh, I just want you doing chain bolts. So we're going to turn that one off. Okay, we've taken one of their Militors down. Oh, you are full on heat. Okay, Militors, you need to move again. Okay, we've taken another one down. We got a stun in. Let's take this guy. Okay, and now I want you guys to just kind of... I guess, like, not quite that. Let's get three of you to spread down here, and then four of you to kind of spread up here. That way we don't have to, like, move all of you every single time. Oh, uh, let's... It's, it's going to be flames, and that's not going to hurt us at all. <laughs> um, Militor one, head down this way. Uh, 
Uh, will you ignore the fire? Ooh, I didn't catch Militor 3. We can resurrect Militor 3. That's no problem. Especially considering we don't have anything, like, queued up right now. Okay, you guys move over here. Priya, let's move you back just a little. Okay, back down. We got it. We got the signal chip. Felicia, come and, uh, well, I guess, unrestricted. Oh, it requires a mechanator. Okay, let's just get you to analyze the signal chip. You guys are free to go. Let's get these guys hauled in. We do have a resurrect job already set up. Um, resurrect late mechanoid. Uh, we can resurrect enemy mechanoids. Uh, I don't want to do that right now. I want to see what mechanoids will be able to make with, um, with an upgrade to our mech tech. So we'll get that taken care of first. Okay, Priya's working on the last advanced component we need. <laughs> She's taking a break to meditate. But we should be able to build sub-persona fabricator building right after that. I think uh, as soon as Felicia is finished researching standard mech tech, then we'll go ahead and throw her in a crypto sleep casket and we will be just droids in the colony. Well, at least that are awake. Um, what does what does mech standard mech tech gets us? It gets us a, a tunnler, which is great because we definitely need the resources. Uh, we can also use them for like body blocking. So I was thinking scythers initially, but we might just like build a couple tunnelers uh, so that they can gather resources for us and then have them do like the body blocking here at the door if we need to. Um, we can do, oh, uh, we could do the standard sub cores so we can like rotate some people in and out to get some of those created. We'll definitely need them for creating these mechs. Uh, a pikeman, pikeman might be good. We don't have very much range right now. It's just Priya that kind of has range. Uh, we do have a mod that allows us to make the signal chips once we've unlocked that research. And we have like a little logistics droid, sublink, control sublink. So that's for control groups. Gestation processor would be great. And we can install multiple of those. We can also do this gear, which we'll need the signal chips for. So we'll probably prioritize making however many signal chips that we need to get her her upgraded gear uh, a ray headset or a mechanator helmet okay we'll have to like take a look at the stats to see which one of those we want and then a bandwidth pack is probably the first thing that we'll make uh bandwidth sublink uh we'll have to take a look at that if that increases her bandwidth we'll want to make some of those and then we also have these various mechanoid themed uh, turrets that we can potentially make and a control tower. This tower can send orders to up to seven mechanoids and the radio waves are able to reach almost 50% further than the mech control beacon. Can we make a mech control beacon right now? Oh, we could. Okay, interesting. Oh, it's really, really cheap. Um... We might just build one of those just to see how much it increases, like, our mech control distance. Um, or we could build the other one. We'll have to see what, like, the resource investment is, because we're really light on Plasteel, and we're mining, like, our steel mining operation is, like, halfway across the map. <laughs> Okay, both of these guys are plus six. This one doesn't require a um, chip. So I think we'll make this one first. This one looks way cooler, but we need two chips for this other band uh, bandwidth pack. Where can we make the chips? I would assume fabrication chip. No, is it here? Um... I don't see it. 
Uh, make bandwidth sublink. Oh, we'll need chips for this as well. Uh, hold on. Where is my research? Let's go mech tech. Uh, let's show completed research. Just for now. Standard. Make a mechanoid band synchron or signal chip. It's necessary to produce advanced type of mechanoids and... Okay, it doesn't tell us where we craft it, though. Signal chip. Well, I will have to figure... Oh, I bet the subcore processor. There we go. Um, okay, they're pretty expensive. We'll make one for now. And that way we can make that that new bandwidth pack for her. And Felicia is off to pop into this crypto sleep casket. I think the other thing that I want to do is get the mech band antenna set up. Um, I'm not sure if I'm ready for a mech queen yet. But we'll get that in preparation so that we're ready to summon her when we can. I think what I want is I definitely want, like, at least a tunneler first and maybe some pikemen so that we have some range. And we'll probably use our little defensive box for that encounter. Okay, we have another raid just, uh, just in time to be volunteers for our crypto sleep gaskets. So they're preparing for a little while, and then we'll see how many of uh, how many more brains we can add to our collection. Okay, they're coming in with an eclipse. And don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Oh my god, <laughs> we're gonna get all of them. Okay, you guys are free to go. You guys are unrestricted again. Um, who is the most injured? Five hours, five hours, six hours. Okay, so carry to crypto sleep caskets, all three of them, and then we'll also like unforbid the things. Uh, Priya, what are you doing? Are you, you're gonna free some memory space? Okay, and then you're gonna grab these guys. Nice, I think. A very productive day. I, did we get a signal chip created? We did not. Oh, may, standard subcores. Oh, we don't need a brain scan. Standard tier mech brain. This. Let's get some of those created. Um, let's get four of them created for now. And we're gonna have to make another. We're gonna have to make another thing, right? Another advanced component chip signal chip you're working on a chip right now so that's where our 14th component went um but we have all the resources that we need for this guy uh, as soon as we get that next component made so made so things are things are coming along things are going really well i'm very excited about it we are resurrecting our next mech and <laughs> we have another raid coming in randy is being crazy um our traps are maybe not going to be all set up for this. I guess we'll have to see how this one goes, but we're running short on time. So we'll open up tomorrow's episode with this raid. We'll see if we can add a few more brains to our brain collection. And then maybe we'll get Priya equipped to summon the mech queen i'm not sure if that's going to happen we need to increase our bandwidth so we have a lot of crafting that we need to do uh and potentially waiting on like the gestation of uh a few more mechs before we take that on but we'll we'll take these guys out and we will get priya on the path to being able to summon that mech queen thanks for hanging out you guys as always until next time have a good one bye